we're all moved in. Well, at least we have all of our stuff moved in. And now I'm just working on putting together an office space, my first official studio. So this is the space. Obviously don't mind the mess. I have my clothes rack over here. I have tons and tons of samples that I still need to find a place for, but yeah, that's kind of the state of things. ordered these custom poster prints that I'm gonna put in picture frames. There's one hung up and then I'm gonna hang up the other two over there. But I just created some fun inspirational posters that just inspire me and I wanted to hang them in the space. So we're gonna set those up right now. Okay, this is the final setup. Got the three posters. I have a full length mirror over here, which is important for me for sample reviews. That way I can just do it all in one space. And then I bought this cork board because I always will write down like random sticky notes. So it's nice to have a place to put them. And then a shelf for all of my supplies. Oh, and I also have Christmas lights. Anyway, this is my design studio. Just picked up another fun package. I'm so excited for this one. So about a month and a half ago, I finished up a 100 day design challenge on my Instagram where I did 100 consecutive days of posting a design around apparel or a product. And I just did that challenge to level up my design skills and my sketching skills. It was just a good way to get lots of repetition. For my day 100 design, I ended up turning one of my favorite concepts of like a lounge set into an actual prototype. And so I had created a tech pack and sent it to my manufacturer and got it sampled, but it turned out so good. And I had a really good response from some family and friends and a few of my other followers that they would actually want them. So I've ordered another round of samples in a few different colorways, a few different fabrics, just to continue this process. And I'm hoping to get these to the point where I'm ready to place an order and hopefully start selling them to you guys. So let me figure out how to open this all these scissors. Okay, I'm going to put this down here. I'm so excited. Cause like right after I finished my 100 day challenge, I just kind of like dove into actually producing these. I'm so excited. <laughs> and so I've been waiting for these samples for oh, probably a couple months. Okay, and they also sent lab bits. So these are all the color options that I have to choose from for the different fabrics. I customized a tag that says keep creating in there. So fun. Okay, the logo is a little big. These are the tops. It's so fun to see these like actually come to life. So these have Gigi Design right here on the pocket and then they also have the keep creating tag on the inside just as like an internal reminder. This is the waffle knit that I chose for the samples so super helpful to see these i'm gonna have to like post these on my instagram and get feedback on which colorways i should go with but i think for sure i want to start with black and then i did brown for my 100 day design challenge and those turned out so cute but yeah this process has like it does take a while like i ordered prototypes about a month and a half ago probably six weeks ago and i'm barely getting my first round of samples and it had taken me, you know, like a week or so to come up with the design and create the tech packs just because I am doing this on the side, um, just like in my own time. If you are thinking about starting an apparel brand, just be aware of timelines. Like if you want to launch, say, 
like right now it's September and say you want to launch by the end of 2023. Truly, it does take six months at the very minimum to get product out. And so I would start planning for the next season. So like right now I'd be planning for April to realistically have products to launch. Ideally, you would want to work like nine to 12 months ahead, but you can work on a six month timeline if you like really push timelines. So let me know in the comments if you have any other questions about product development, product design, and I can show some more behind the scenes stuff. Okay, this is me talking through a few minor fit updates for my manufacturer. There were just a few small things we needed to change before sending the style into production. But if you are interested in purchasing one of these on sets, be sure to subscribe to my email list. I'll be sure to put a link in the description below and follow my Instagram to stay updated on the status of this style. It's kind of an exciting day. So I've just finished sample reviews on my lounge set. I've been having a few discussions with people about them. We're making a few updates to the fit. Um, we're talking through different colors and right now I'm working on placing my bulk order, which is exciting. It's exciting when a style gets to the point where it's ready to place a bulk order because after months of sampling, doing sample reviews, finally getting to the point where your style is ready to go is super, super exciting. My first payment is officially complete for my bulk order. Just thought I'd document it. And that about wraps up the video. If you're new here, my name is Paige. I design apparel for a living and I'm on YouTube to document my creative process and my creative journey. So if you're new here, subscribe, follow along for more. See you in the next video. Don't look at the camera. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.